Hello, I'm simple squamous epithelia, and I'm the thinnest tissue that you've got. I'm an epithelial tissue, so I face the outside world, but because I'm so very thin, and there's only one layer of cells in me, then it's really easy for things to pass through. And so for diffusion or secretion even, I'm a perfect choice if you need things, even gases, to diffuse through a very thin layer. That's what I'm good for. Hello, I am simple cuboidal epithelia. Because I'm a simple epithelium with only one layer of cells, I'm very good at secretion and absorption. And this particular simple cuboidal epithelium here, this has a number of channels and pumps which can take substances the body wants, which are in the lumen, and then have them pass through the cell into the bloodstream so that they are not lost. Some of these cells even may respond to some of the hormones which affect the fluid balance in the body. So this is a tissue for secretion and absorption with a couple of specializations for the specific site it's designed for. Her Simple columnar epithelia here. Now, as a simple epithelium, materials can easily be secreted or absorbed into the bloodstream which lies deep to me. And this particular simple columnar epithelium which you see here, this has microvilli which specializes in increasing the surface area for secretion and absorption. And there are lots of enzymes which are attached to these microvilli, which allow large molecules to be broken up into small molecules and later absorbed. That applies to this particular simple columnar epithelium. I am simple columnar epithelium, but I am ciliated, which means that if you need things transported, then this cilia can create a current in fluid which allows things to be transported through the lumen of the tubule. This is pseudostratified epithelia. I'm really not stratified. I just look like I'm stratified, but I'm not. But of particular interest are the goblet cells which secrete mucus, which catches stuff, and then the cilia which can beat the mucus away. And so between the mucus secreted, which will catch any debris, and cilia being able to sweep this mucus with its debris away, I have a very particular function. Hello, transitional epithelia here. I have the unique ability to stretch out very long, and then I can return to a more cuboidal shape. So I can look either to be squamous as I stretch, or cuboidal as I relax. And I am very good at stretching. Hi, I'm stratified squamous epithelia. I am stratified, which means that I have many layers of cells. You don't want me in an area where you need a lot of diffusion because because of all these cells, things don't diffuse through me very easily. Instead, I'm here for your protection so that if something abrasive passes, then if some cells are lost, there are other cells underneath them which can take their place. So I serve for protection. Hello, man. I am not only stratified squamous epithelia, stratified meaning that I have many layers. I'm keratinized stratified squamous epithelium on, which means that my outer layers are full of keratin. In fact, the cells eventually die and become nothing more than interlocked bags of keratin. Keratin is fairly waterproof, and all of these layers serve as protection. So I have a very important function.